Hello everyone, this is AJ with Two Noobs One Game, and today I'm showing you Minecraft Beta 1.8 pre-release. This is the leaked version of Minecraft, and it's not out yet, but you can get it. I can't tell you how though, because that would be breaking copyright laws, and I'd get my channel kicked off YouTube. But anyways, Dustin's not here, I don't know if he's heard about it yet, but uh, as you can see, <laughs> the background looks pretty cool. And uh, just for you, I sent my broken turtle beaches back to get fixed, and I made an impromptu, impromptu microphone out of the rock band microphone, or the Guitar Hero World Tour microphone, and a piece of styrofoam to hold it up. So, I'm going to first of all show you um, creative mode, which is pretty sweet, uh, just so I can show you the new things in it. It's a bit slow, and I'm pretty sure this video is going to lag. So I apologize for that. Um, it's a pre-release, so it's pretty, mm, I don't know, s m slow and unresponsive sometimes. Anyways, we have some weird new tree structure. Uh, I guess a, a certain new variety. And here's some vines. Pretty legit. And then um, in creative mode, you can see that we have the new item selection window with a few new things in it, most notably oops, uh, stone bricks, stone brick slab, um, we have iron bars which are a good way to keep people <laughs> or animals in, uh, some detector rails I'm pretty sure you can set that, um, no new tools or any new ores, um, chicken actually drop chicken now and you can cook that as you see fit um, rotten flesh with I, I think it's from zombies ender pearls from the endermen which is really creepy and then melons and pumpkin seeds so you can now grow pumpkins on your own without having to find them well you'd have to find them to begin with I think and then you get watermelon can you eat it? Eat, eat. Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it's creative mode. You can't eat things in creative mode. But uh, creative mode lets you break blocks instantly. So you just like run through things. Bam. And it lets you play some limited blocks. So if I want to make a little fence to keep my piggies in, if I had piggies to put in my fence, I would do this. And Viola. It's better than regular fence, I would assume. Um, something else I want to show you while I'm here is that creative mode has a new way for you to get around too. As we double click the space bar, it initiates fly mode. Shift descends, space ascends, double click it again, and you fall. So it's pretty legit. I think creative mode is pretty cool if you want to create stuff. I don't know why they don't give you the option of making a flat plane map, but yeah. <laughs> I guess it's good enough. Uh, I don't think uh, the villages are done, but I think Endermen might be in. So we're going to start a survival world, generate structures, and we'll see if we can find a village or some dungeons or something, something new. Building, 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 terrain, to to terrain. Okay, we're done. Hey, watermelon. Oh, and it's gone. As you can see, the new hunger bar, along with the experience bar. Um, I don't know if you know this already, but you can really brighten it up. I think it was brightness there before. I don't think it was. I don't know. Um, everything is really the same in here except the field of view can be changed now so Minecraft can look really trippy and it's really slow doing this so I'm not going to do that. But anyways, uh, I'm going to punch some chickens. Hey, whoa, 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 they're fast. Did he speed chickens up? Did Notch speed chickens up? Oh god. And voila, we get chicken and XP. Come here, you little chicken. You little piece of poop. Actually, you know what? No, I can't make a sword. I need a crafting table. That's too much. We need to adventure. These vines are kind of annoying, and in my opinion, a little bit ugly. 
but I guess we have spawned in a mushroom rich world. Oops, that's not what I wanted. I need mushrooms. Quite convenient. Oh, these chickens. Why didn't I get any XP for- Ah, it doesn't even matter. Whoa! Uh, also, I don't know if you've uh, heard this, but there's a new terrain generator in 1.8, and apparently it makes gigantic monoliths of stone and dirt. Holy crap, what the heck? Ooh, this is neat. <laughs> I don't really understand how the terrain generator, which is supposedly supposed to make things more realistic, can say that giant cliffs and floating islands are realistic. Regardless, ooh, maybe we can find something new in here. I don't have torches. Whoa, 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 oh god. <laughs> I could have saw that coming. Hey, they're not glowing red. That's weird. I don't like that. Give me some XP, sucker. Or don't. Oh, jeez. Why are they so hard to kill? Holy crap. Uh, oh. Hello there, Mr. Creeper. Do I get XP for that? I should. I think I did. <laughs> I mean, there really isn't that much new. Ooh, ooh. That you can see in the beta one point, or not beta, this isn't beta anymore. Sucker. Oh, that's what Dustin was talking about with the explosions. Did you notice there were like crescents along with the smoke? Interesting. Um, I guess, uh, oh, I'm trapped. But endermen are quite rare. I guess, wait, why is my health healing? Difficulty normal, I guess health automatically heals slowly, maybe? I don't know. But, uh, what, as I was saying, I guess Endermen, ooh, the bow has changed. I don't know if you can tell if the image for the bow has changed. Oh, I'm about to die. And I think it, skeletons hit harder. <laughs> it looks like they do. Anyways, I'm going to fast forward this video until night and we'll see if we can find some Endermen and be freaked the F out. It's not night yet, but I wanted to show you something I just realized. When things die, they drop weird XP orbs, which I never knew. I suppose I should have if I was following the updates. But if you watch when I kill this chicken, this grass is kind of annoying though. You can see those little orbs right there, and they'll slowly come to me and give me my XP. So let's see what happens when you level up. Also, I made a sword. I'm a little sad because I usually use too many items to cheat. Holy crap, what? Ha, huh. I don't want to go down there. And it looks like there's like a volcano or something over there. Whoa, that's big. That's what she said. Anyways, I'm gonna go level up. Level myself up. This grass is really annoying and I can see it being really annoying when you're trying to kill things. Oh, well, I just increased the level. And nothing happened. I don't think so. Let's check my stats. No? Huh. Well, I guess that's meaningless. I'm sure there's something to it, but I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to be back again at night unless I come across something neato. So I'll see you then. Another quick uh, change. Pigs have noses now. Look at them. How cute. He's looking at me. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, they have noses, they pop out, they're three-dimensional, whoopie, 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 and I came over here, one of my trees was on fire, I guess it's not one of my trees, but there's a pond of lava right here, you, you never see that really in the actual game, 1.7 and previous, next to a puddle, so there you go, you can make some obsidian, I guess. And some little wolves. Woof woofs. Wolves, nothing different about them. They haven't changed. Uh, it's still not getting dark. So, it's time to pause again. It's finally starting to get dark now. And I believe, as you can tell, there's a, a difference in... Ooh, shoot. 
and lighting now, instead of getting darker in waves, it gradually gets darker as the brightness goes down. So look, it's dusk now, and the sun's going down, and it's really actually kind of beautiful over there, Minecraft-wise, as it slowly gets darker. See, it's just one gradual thing instead of updating block by block. But I've come across this weird valley while I was looking. There's like mountains literally on every side and floating things. The terrain generator in 1.8 is incredible. And there's a zombie. I'm gonna kill it. Come here, Mr. Zombie. Monster Hunter. What did I get? I got rotten flesh. Can we eat this? My hunger's going. Nope. Oh, I wonder what you do with it then. Oh, you hold it down to eat it. That's pretty cool. Oh, what does this mean? Does this mean I'm a zombie? How do I go into third person? That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. I, I, oh, I'm a creeper. Wait, I don't understand. What does this mean? I ate zombie flesh and now my hunger bar is glowing? Huh. Maybe I get hungry faster. Maybe I, I eat brains. Can you eat brains? Are there any brains around here for me to eat? Oh, shh. Oh, God. No, 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 no. I didn't want to come across one so soon. Whoa, that was creepy. Really creepy. If I turn my back on it, will it... Oh! Um. Shoot. Oh! Uh, that, that was scary. There's another one over there. I don't think he sees me yet. But if I turn my back, will he appear? That's what they do, isn't it? I don't know. Oh, he is drowning. Endermen don't like water. Huh. They're really not as scary, terrifyingly strong as not suggested. It's still kind of frightening how they pick up things and look like giant men. But. Other than that, oh, there's a mountain in the distance. Uh, Endermen are supposed to be pretty rare, but I guess they aren't really. Enderman he doesn't even look at me. Hello, hello. Am I meaningless to Enderman? Oh yeah, he totally saw me now. And the fact that I think his mouth is open, and he's looking at me, kind of freaks me out. And he just disappeared. Huh. Doesn't, doesn't he want to kill me? I don't, oh! What is this? These baby creepers? They look too small to be real creepers. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> wow, okay. Maybe they're not baby creepers. Have creepers gotten smaller? They look smaller to me. Huh. Oh well. I thought they were cute baby creepers. Oh well. But anyways, that's like pretty much all that's in 1.8 right now. In the pre-release. Villages aren't done. They, they can be found. But there aren't any NPCs in it. And... I don't think anything else is implemented actually, so we'll have to wait for the 1.8 uh, physical release to see uh, more about what's in store. Oh, there's a little 
group of mobs up there and a skelly. Anyways, this has been AJ <laughs> with Two Noobs One Game. And if this is our first, or excuse me, if this is your first Two Noobs One Game video that you've watched, make sure you subscribe to us because we have pretty funny videos, my friend Dustin and I. And uh, stay tuned for more 1.8 videos when more comes out. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.